everyone's having an awesome day. This is my wall. Everything's gone. Like, this was covered with stuff. And now it's gone because last day of classes is today. Woo! Yay! I'm so excited. Um, today was my final day of classes. And also, it was the day of my interview for the education school because I want my major to be elementary education. So I had to uh, go to an interview today. So fingers crossed. I'm so excited. Next week is finals week and then I'm done. I'm so excited. So today's video is just kind of like an update video and also some important information that you're going to need to know before you go down on your Disney college program. The last couple weeks were really crazy. I came down with a really bad sinus infection, so I ended up being in bed for a while. Then we ended up finding out my mom has cancer, so I ended up having to go help her out. She had to do a surgery and stuff. She's fine now, so everything's good. They got the cancer out, which is thumbs up. And just other crazy stuff has been going on. So, anyways, basically today, we're going to talk about things you need to do before the college program. Do your onboarding paperwork. When you get accepted, there's this thing called onboarding paperwork that's going to be on the onboarding site. Basically, that's really important. It's a lot of different stuff. It's a lot of signatures. It's a lot of reading you have to do. So I would start it, you know, when you get a chance, when you're bored, when you're procrastinating for finals, things like that. I would definitely do something like that. You have to bring it with you to Florida. So definitely put it somewhere safe and keep it. Talk to your university about what's going on. I'm getting four credits for my program, and I'm taking two sociology classes, through my university and I'm also taking two classes while I'm down there. Should be good. I know I had to sign paperwork saying that I had to give up my housing for the semester but I do have paperwork so that I can get it back when I come back because it's like an internship with UConn. Definitely talk to your university as soon as you find out you got in to get some information about what's going on. Also you're gonna have to tell your parents or your parental guardians what's going on, like where you're going, that you're going to Florida, things like that. Pay your fees, your acceptance fees, because that pays for your rent for the first couple weeks, I think, and things like that. And then start getting excited, start getting ready, you know. I know I'm really excited. I just have finals, and then I'm done, so I'm pretty pumped. And to be good, just be excited about it, you know. You made it in. You did it. So that's great. You're going down to Florida. I'm really, really excited. My room is, like, all packed away already. Like, a lot of it is just in boxes and bags. Like, it's so depressing. <laughs> like, I already took stuff home over Thanksgiving break, but, like, now it's just, like, barren. <laughs> Roommate matching just opened. So for people who are going down January 9th, like I am, roommate matching just opened, so you can go do that. I actually have roommates, which is kind of exciting. I'm rooming with my friend Christina, and then we're also going to be living with our new friends Sam and Casey, so that should be really fun. We want to live in Chatham. I'm just, I'll be happy wherever, as long as I'm down there. Like, that's all that matters. My roommate Christina is really nice. We both go to the same school. We're both in the same year. We're both in the same club, Disney at UConn, so we're both going to live together. And then Sam's from Massachusetts, and Casey is from Wisconsin. I'm going to be flying down to Florida, so it's going to be, like, a different packing experience. Like, if you look up packing vlogs on YouTube, a lot of them are for people who are bringing cars down. It's not the case with me because I'm from Connecticut, and I don't want to have to make the haul down there. So, basically, what Christina and I are going to be flying down. So, it's going to be interesting. We're going to have to buy a lot of stuff down there or get a lot of stuff shipped to us because... It, we're not going to have a lot of space, but Southwest, two bags for free. Yay. So I'm going to be doing a packing vlog, not now, but like I'm going to do a packing vlog over winter break before I'll do a film kind of packing vlog, and that should be fun. So I misplaced my iPod um, right at the beginning of the semester. I was really bummed. It was in my room, but I didn't know where it was. And it had like, it has a lot of like 2,000 songs on it, and my computer only has like 100, so I'm like dying without it. And I just found it. So I'm pretty excited. And this is the wrong time. It's so weird, like, leaving. It's crazy. Like, I <laughs> leaving my room and, like, leaving my roommate, it's going to be so weird. Because it feels like I just got here and now I'm leaving. Because it's different than, like, a whole year away. It's just, like, a half year. And it's weird. Like, the next time I'm going to have finals is a year from now. Which is crazy. <laughs> which I like. Don't get me wrong. But it's crazy. My goal for when I'm down there is definitely to continue to vlog. Um, I know I got sick and that's why I didn't vlog. But I definitely want to keep vlogging while I'm down there. I hear it's really hard to vlog. Like I hear like you could take video. But like editing it and doing stuff like that. It's going to be really rough. But I'm going to like set like two hours of time a week to like vlog or something. 
don't know, but we will we will find out. All right, so I will talk to you all later. Have a magical day. Bye.